Hey everyone, this is Bree from Bree the Juice Lady on YouTube and Instagram. Um, um, Juice World Cold Press Juices. I know I talk about colonics a lot, colonic hydrotherapy, and today I'm in my treatment. Of course, I'm going to do waist up. But I wanted to interview my um, colonic hydrotherapist and my friend Andrea. And so she can give you a little more understanding of what colonics do, how it benefits you, and what's safe and how much is safe. Because many people say, well, you shouldn't get that often. Or, you know, I don't think all of that water going into your um, digestive tract is safe enough. It's safe. It, it, it'll wash everything out that you need. So we're going to get some, some clarity today. And I want to introduce my colonic hydrotherapist, Andrea. Hi there. Hey, Andrea. <laughs> Andrea is a colonic hydrotherapist, and I'm going to just let her take the floor and talk about colonic hydrotherapy and how it benefits us. Okay, so when you have a colonic, also known as colon hydrotherapy, we're doing a series of fills and releases. The water's going to travel the whole five and a half feet of your colon. It's going to soften things up and allow them to pass easily. Some people pass everything through the tubing while they're on the table. Some people pass everything in the toilet at the end. And some people do both. It doesn't matter so much, but it's kind of fun to watch it go by the tube. We have a viewing tube here. Right. We can, you know, laugh, not laugh. Some people want to see everything. Some people don't want to see anything. <laughs> um, me, I like to see everything. Me That's too. why I'm a great colon therapist. Yeah. But, um... As far as washing the good bacteria out of your colon, that is a fallacy. There's been two studies to show that that's not true, but what we are doing is creating a really good environment for good bacteria to grow. Right. So when you have a colonic and you get rid of all that toxic gunk, mm -hmm. the good bacteria is more free to grow. So we recommend that people do uh, a double dose of probiotics for a week after their colonic and then go to the normal dosage afterwards. Mm -hmm. um, there's also another rumor that likes to fly around the internet that there's a risk of perforation with the colonic. That okay. has never happened. That happens with colonoscopy, but never with colon hydrotherapy. Right. Um, safety. Very safe, very peaceful, very benign. And one of the great things about colon hydrotherapy, besides cleaning your colon, is it hydrates you. It hydrates mm -hmm. you so well, it flushes all your glands and organs. The FDA actually allows us to claim that. There's four claims the FDA allows us to make besides that we're cleaning your colon. One is we're hydrating your whole body. Right. If you look at this chart we're reshaping the colon into a healthier shape we're exercising the colon like going to the gym for your colon the fills and the releases actually tone the muscle of your colon mm -hmm. and last but not least we're stimulating all the reflex points that are located in your colon they're like little electrical connections to all your glands and organs something like acupuncture but mm -hmm. different so. And that's why I, I also say how cleaning the colon and keeping it cleaned and nourished, it assists in spirituality as well. It's, it's not just here on earth. Yeah, so we're cleaning our body. We're taking out the things that we don't need. We're trying to replace it with what we do need. So colonic hydrotherapy is a part of that. It, it helps. It assists the colon and becoming back to trying as close as back to normal as it can get. You know, and that's also based on you too, of what you put in and how you take care of your body. So yes, it's connected to spirituality. It's connected to um, you know, clarity of the mind, your thoughts. Mm -hmm. um, you, To be honest, I turned into a whole different person since I started doing this and juicing and things like that. So it is definitely a positive, um, a, a positive experience. Yeah, so, you know, our emotions are in our gut. You'll notice mm -hmm. that when you're stressed, when you're excited, some people have instant diarrhea, some people get constipated, we make serotonin in our gut. It's very important to keep our gut clean and healthy mm -hmm. so that we can be all we're supposed to be. Nobody feels well mm -hmm. when they're all gunked up. 
And some people will say, oh, but I have a bowel movement every day. Well, we brush our teeth every day as well. You still right. go to the dentist. There's plenty of work to do. And you don't want to wait for a cavity. At all. So <laughs> it's the other end of the same 35-foot digestive tract. So wow. it's important to pay attention to. People take better care of their nails than they do of their insides. It's, mm -hmm. it's very important. Right. So, again, y'all, I wanted to jump on to sh just give you some insight of colonic hydrotherapy, co colon hydrotherapy. I'm not saying it wrong, but it's all the same. We answer co to anything. Right. Colon hydrotherapy. I come monthly. That's my choice. And I feel great. And I'm just trying to live my best life. So, with that again, I'm Bree the Juice Lady. Like, share, subscribe. And until next time, take care. Peace and love.